Our church uses the phrase, God's work, our hands, to connect things divine and things of this earth. Uh, it's incarnational. I understand that to mean that God's work is revealed in the earthly things that we do with our hands, which means that all the ministries that the congregation members of Trinity do, whether it is time or talent or treasure, reveal God's work. The ministries in the congregation and in the community, in the synod and throughout the world, make manifest what God is doing in all of those places. As a son of missionaries overseas, I have seen this firsthand. Many congregations in many places in this country work together to provide enough support that my folks could do full-time work in a setting that could not afford to support them. And that helped establish the church in Malaysia and in Singapore, which are now partner churches in the global communion of the Lutheran World Federation, along with our church. Those churches are now self-sufficient and they're sending missionaries to Cambodia and to Madagascar. That's the kind of thing that we are also continuing to do in the synod. Gifts of time and talent and treasure are making it possible for us to provide full-time pastoral ministry in two communities in Pittsburgh that cannot support their own work and our hope is to grow that into urban and rural communities around our synod. Thank you for your ministry in this synod, in your community and around the world, doing God's work with your hands. Trinity's ministries are diverse and far-reaching. There are so many opportunities for our members to get involved and make a difference in both our community and our world. Our ongoing ministries, such as the Shepherd Shop, Used Furniture Ministry, and the Quilting Group, have provided household items and blankets for those in need. The Stephen Ministry Program, Simiana Visitors, and Pearls of Prayer have each provided comfort and support during times of loneliness, grief, and illness. And let's not forget world hunger. With your donations, we are able to fight malaria, provide fruit trees, farm animals, and clean water throughout the world. Locally, we can participate in special activities such as the Food Bank and Fresh Express, Vacation Bible School, the Thanksgiving and Christmas Day dinners, and the Christmas Basket distribution. Last fall, 175 school kits were assembled and sent to Georgia for distribution. Our rummage sale in April raised over $1,900 for the Union Missions Building Fund. And just last month, Trinity's Blood Drive brought in 26 pints of whole blood. For our next event, which will be on October the 1st, we invite you to be God's hands and participate in the assembling of our personal care kits. With the goal of 500 kits, we will need all the hands we can get. Then, on October 6th and 7th, a bus trip is being planned to deliver the kits to New Windsor, Maryland, which is the distribution center for Lutheran World Relief. The first day will involve touring and volunteering at the distribution center. The second day will be spent visiting Lutheran World Relief headquarters and hearing two important presentations then spending a fun afternoon at the Inner Harbor of Baltimore. So please support our ministries here at Trinity. Use your hands to accomplish God's work.
In what ways are you supporting the ministries and missions of Trinity with your time, talents, and treasures? Things left to lie dormant fade away. Things used daily and practiced diligently increase and flourish. Faith grows from our relationship with God and his promises of love and mercy. It opens us to a life of bold trust in God and joyful, generous service to everyone we know and meet in our daily life. We can deepen our faith through listening to the scriptures, daily devotions, being involved in the ministries of the church, and by using our gifts of time, talents, and treasures in God's service. Just think of what could be accomplished if we all had a mustard seed of faith. 